Hey y'all, this is Storm from Taylor Made Popery and Bust Stuff Gaming. And today I'm going to show you a quick video on how to upload your videos and your images back onto your PS4. And I want to note, you may have downloaded them as screenshots, but when you try to re-upload them, they will not upload as screenshots. They will upload as sticker overlays. And that's the only way you can use them. So just uh, make sure you know that right off the bat. And also, something you may want to note is that the resolution, you downloaded all these screenshots from your PS4, and they'll download a resolution of 1920 by 1080. But when you go to try to put them back up on there, it says resolution's not supported, so you have to re-upload them and resize them to... 1280 by 720 that's the maximum resolution that the image sticker supports so you get those changed and you can input the images from the USB back onto your share factory program and use them as stickers next thing is is video say you're trying to upload a video and you keep getting an iframe error it won't upload well I use a free program called Handbrake what you want to do is download it and then you want to go on the main screen you click on open source and you either can do a single or a batch file of videos say you're just working on one uh, you select that video and up at the top left corner open source then you go to the tab that says video tab once you open up that video tab you'll see the extra option block and in that extra option block, you're going to type in K-E-Y-I-N-T equals 30. K-E-Y-I-N-T equals 30. And this will eliminate that iframe error that you get for your video because the PS4 only supports up to 30. And then what you want to do is set your destination folder to your USB. And on your USB, you want to already have made up a folder called Share Factory with a subfolder for video or imp for video, and using and set that as your destination folder. And then all you got to do is click on Start Encode, and you'll be able to upload it and be able to use it in your Share Factory project. This is just want to can't reemphasize that when you bring your screenshots back onto your PS4 they are stickers and they're overlays so you cannot just add them in between clips you have to create a clip and the best way to do that is the way I do is use a solid color and I input the image overlay it use the transform to maximum size it and it makes it look like a screenshot so uh, this is Storm from Taylor Made Popery and Buff Stuff Gaming. Hope y'all have a great day. Hope it helps you. As always, thank you for that.